when I bring my friends over here, they go, oh, really? That's going on right over there? Margaret Friedman has been a teacher at Oakview Elementary School for 17 years. This is the view from her classroom. The school's neighbor is Rainbow Environmental Services. And it processes construction waste, green waste, and most importantly, it processes trash. Tons and tons of trash every single day. She's one of many who say the smell from the facility is unbearable and has been making students sick. It's not bad. It's pretty horrible. Well, my sister has even gotten sent home because of how bad the, the, the order is that she throws up. The smell isn't their only complaint. This is recent video of seagulls flying over the school. They poop on the lunch tables. They poop everywhere. Kids run to our awnings to escape the seagulls. And they leave behind bones, leftovers from the scraps they've picked up at Rainbow just 100 feet away. Teachers say the facility has also been crushing concrete, sending potentially harmful dust onto the campus. The kids sometimes come in from lunch and from playing and they have concrete dust on them. You know, concrete is a carcinogen. This is something that should not be allowed. The South Coast Air Quality Management District has issued four violations to the company in the past six months, most recently in March. School board members say they're fed up with the mess. The Ocean View School District is now suing. They are conducting illegal uh, garbage processing operation. They are tipping and they're sorting and they're transferring solid waste, raw garbage outside an enclosure. It's supposed to be inside of a building. They've said they might consider enclosing one of them, but that's not enough. There's a huge, gigantic open area where they just take whole trucks full of chicken bones and fish pickings and dump it out on the open ground. How is it allowed in 2015 that we can have Surf City USA have an open trash dump literally uncovered in our city. A trial is set for October where they'll let a jury decide if this facility is a public nuisance. We did reach out to Rainbow Environmental Services for a comment. They said it's not company policy to comment on litigation. In Huntington Beach, Casey Montoya, KTLA 5 News.